All right, we are here with Crash the Titans this time with Spider Woman, and we got Agent. I mean, not Agent Venom, Anti Venom. All right, so let's take a look at Spider Woman's abilities, and then we'll look at you know Anti Venom and go from there. So she's a black, purple, and red user, similar to Anti Venom. Her black ability costs nine, creates a three turn countdown tile, or creates a countdown tile that resists, uh, well, as long as it, it exists, she resists uh, some amount of damage uh, dealt to her. I'm surprised they didn't put this at level five. Uh, her purple ability, love and fear, uh, the, this cost was it eight i believe i believe it's eight and uh the love version will destroy any uh any of her special tiles that are on the board that belong to us uh the fear version creates uh four trap tiles on the board and if they're matched away by us it does some amount of damage and then finally her red ability which costs 14 uh it stuns a random target for two turns and it does a boatload of damage um the portion about the about the enemy team doing i mean de de ah, dealing damage or having damage dealt to them is kind of irrelevant all right we got anti-venom and brock i'll make sure that they're on, they're on those boos so he's a you know black yellow i mean black purple and red user just like jessica um his black ability and aggressive antibodies cost none uh it heals the team for a burst of health and creates creates web tiles and then whenever we heal an ally passively, um, anti-venom deals damage to the target equal to whatever the amount healed. So, you know, you got lower thresholds at three and five, and obviously at four. Adaptive clothing costs six on purple. It creates a repeater tile on the board that removes any enemy special tiles that's on the board. But if there are no enemy special tiles on the board, then it'll just, it'll do, you know, the listed damage. Uh, but if there is a special tile that's on the board that belongs to the enemy, then it'll create a web tile and then another repeater tile. And then at lower levels, it's a two turn repeater tile. And then finally, uh, Precision Purge, believe this costs eight of seven. Um, so you destroy all purple and yellow web tiles on the board and you give an ally a burst of health plus additional health for each tile that's destroyed and then at higher levels, you know, more health and more additional health. All right. If you're... You're using a lower level anti-venom, we're gonna go, go ahead and get into the fight and not, not keep the preamble going. But if you're a lower level anti-venom, you're obviously are going to want to to focus on purple. You wanna get you wanna deny as much black as possible because seeking redemption will nullify any health health uh I mean any damage that that's done to Jessica. All right. So we'll get a quick seven thousand once this is done. Now imagine if she had her her um love. I mean her uh, secret redemption out. Okay. We are back. I had to take a I had to take a brief, brief commercial break. Um, but the main thing you really 
I said that would have that really would have messed us up as if we had um we had to deal deal with the seeking redemption tile like that would have really messed us up until we get another another aggressive antibodies let's make sure we match something to not have purple and boom she's done That's all the, uh, all the stuff there. Alright, all the rewards. And again, this is, this is the first time that I got in. I want to thank the Alliance for playing, as always. Got a heroic 10 pack, three more days to Negasonic, so let's, whoops not go there though i have to give out some some team ups well, let's look at look at old eddie shall we first aggressive antibodies again they it's a solid solid healing move you know they even though like some of the some of the members of the uh, the the spider the spider team have much better heals. Looking at silk, this one here, you know, is an additional additional way to to heal off, and you know, that that's you know that's a way to that to keep keep yourself healed, especially if you if you're using. If you're using silks black for something, or if you're using uh, what's my boy's name, um, Miguel O'Hara, and then of course the you know the is a if anti venom heals, you know deals damage to the target or or heals an ally, you know so you know be mindful. Be mindful of that there too. All right, adaptive clothing. Um, this is this is actually one of the well, I'm not gonna call it a more unique move, but it's a more how can I put it a a different way of doing well it's well actually it's similar to uh to kitty pride's uh purple ability but instead of it being a passive a passive version it's it's more of an active version and when it you know when it reaches zero i mean when, it, when peter tower reaches zero it'll do you know it'll do damage just like hers but you know, if there's uh, any special tile, special tile still around, you know, it's gonna still, still linger about. Um, but yeah, like I said, it's a, a really odd version of, of, of Four Star Kitty Pride's um, special repeater tile. And then the red ability, Precision purge. I the only reason why I have this here set to set to three is because I don't you know you kinda you kinda wanna keep web tiles on the board, especially if you're using you know your your web users. So so someone like um Miles Morales or or uh what's her name? Uh, Spider Gwen, you know, so so you want to try and try and keep keep some number of web tiles on the board. Uh, again, Miles's yellow, I mean y Miles's red's a little bit better than um, you know than this here, and again, I would rather. I would rather use 
either Miles is red or Spider Gwen's red, you know, for the um for the damage, you know. Again, the burst health is okay, but you know, you got better uses of the red if you're, you know, part of the spider team. And of course, you know, Heroes and Spider Verse is um that anti-venom's affiliations so as far as you know the, the heroes heroes to go with um with anti-venom you know someone someone like uh five star spider-man obviously is that what oh, i mean by five star spider-man i, I mean Five star, five star Peter Parker. Yeah, that's the Spider-Man I'm talking about. Because again, his uh, web shot automatically, automatically starts to turn with the web tiles, and of course, I would have this here at five. So you can create, you can create web tiles. Again, the um, his web shot will be a much better use of your red than with then with um, any Brock mainly because again critical tiles are are awesome so you know that's an option there um then I'm trying to think of the four star the four star web users um starting from Miles Morales Again, he, he can create create some yellow with his uh I mean well anytime you match away any web tiles he'll he'll create some some AP or generate some AP. Uh again his purple ability you can go invisible so it so you got a little flexibility there is a on on whether or not you want uh oh my goodness this is on the tip of my tongue whether or not you want to go invisible or if you want to go um and create the peter tiles oh my goodness they i should not be uh should be, shouldn't be brain freezing like that there sorry gang um of course um spider gwen aka ghost spider she she has a um she's got she's got her stun on on purple so you might have a little a few conflicts there You got uh, again her yellow ability creates web tiles, and then her red punches you in the face. So again, you got that option there. You got uh, Spider-Man 2099. Anytime you match uh, purple, black, I mean not purple, but black, blue, and yellow, you know that'll create some web tiles on the color green. So that's an option, and then of course he can stun on blue, and then his black ability will uh, create one turn countdown tiles that'll do damage to random targets. Uh, what is my girl Silk? Like she's an option with the um, so with her blue ability to to create either. Uh, strike attack or protect tiles with total recall her yellow ability to to generate you know some some web tiles on the board and and um fortify them or you know using the black ability for you you know creating creating uh tiles on green and even more strike tiles oh uh, who else is on missing oh spider-man um Infinity War, if I can ever find him. As long as Spider-Man Infinity War has uh, more levels on on folks, you know, this blue ability, uh, anytime you match 
you match his uh match his or whatever he makes a match great web tiles on the board and then you know you say yeah it's gonna suck that he removes all you say half of web tiles whenever he takes um uh, more damage um on him you know that's gonna suck All right, you got uh, his green ability, which which will create uh, web tiles on the board and unlock some number of tiles. And then his red ability, you know, is is an uncapped power that depends on however many web tiles you have on the board, and then you know your you know your supports or whatever. Um, but I really wouldn't pair him up with pair. Anti Venom up with any non non web users for the simple fact that he needs webs to generate stuff and and other characters are are better off doing their thing in terms of using you know the web tile I mean either their special abilities like America Chavez like she's better off using her abilities instead of you know having Agent Venom, I mean Anti Venom, to do his stuff, and obviously you can't pair uh, Eddie Brock with with the four star version of Venom, but you can pair him with Anti Venom. But Anti Venom isn't gonna really work because he doesn't really create any web tiles. So that should, well, yeah, I think that will end in the video today. Um. Knock out, so I knock out all the rest of the Crash of the Titans. I mean, uh, not the Crash of the Titans, but the uh, what's the name stuff Deadpool Daily before I gotta go through PvP and and, P and the rest of PvE and do all that stuff there. And the next fight in four days and eight hours will be Infinity War Thanos or Endgame Thanos. So I'll have. I'll have at least one team in particular with him involving a a cybernetic um, a cybernetic Corbinite and and the daughter of Magneto. So there's your there's your tease for for that video, and I'll catch you guys in a couple of days with introducing Wanda and then of course the tokens token Thanksgiving uh, for oh Gamora Shang-Chi Ultron and hopefully maybe some Icarus covers but that's gonna be third that's gonna be Thursday along with another another puzzle gauntlet so yeah, so Wanda, Wanda, I think Tuesday, I think that's that's about right with the introducer. So Wanda Tuesday, um, then the uh, oh my goodness, I just set with the events. Where is the puzzle gauntlet? And then we'll do some, we'll do some pulls, and um, and then Thanos will be somewhere. Somewhere between that it looks like Thanos might be Wednesday five day if you know all that there. So I'm done rambling, done done getting getting the agenda set up. You guys have guys and guys have a good night.